Welcome to Visual Arts with Leo Green. What is visual art class? Visual art education is an area of learning based upon the kind of art one can see visually, drawing, painting, printmaking, and design and jewelry, pottery, weaving, etc. And designs to move particular fields such as commercial graphics and home furnishing. How do I teach visual arts? Well, I teach visual arts with the elements and principles of design. The elements of art are line, shape, form, space, texture, value, and color. The principles of art are balance, emphasis, harmony, movement, proportion, rhythm, and variety. Here are some examples of different elements of art and how we might see them in the world. How we see line, how we see shape, how we see form and space, texture, value, and color. The principles of art govern the way the elements of art go together. We can see balance, variety, movement, harmony, proportion, rhythm, and emphasis. These pictures give an example of how principles of art are used. Here are some examples of some of the artwork that we do in visual art class. Here you see grid drawings. Grid drawings help us capture the correct proportions taken from a picture. This is inspired by artist Chuck Close. He used grid drawings to make hyper-realistic artwork. Line, an element of art, is used in this project. This fun collage mixed with making different line designs so students can reckon that lines can close to make either geometric shapes or organic shapes. These wacky line designs help students create wild bad hair days for their figure. Scratch art is a really challenging but rewarding medium to use. In the design, the user must scratch away what they want to be the highlighted area and whatever is left is darkened in there. With contrast, one is able to make a clear picture using hatching, cross hatching, and stippling. When I teach the principle of art balance, I like to use a CD cover. A CD cover has three different sides and balance has three different types of balance. You have formal balance, which is a mirror-like reflection. Informal balance, where it is asymmetrical and it's not the same on both sides. And you have radial balance, which is formal balance, however you slice it, like a pizza or a pie. Towards the end of the semester, I would like to have a virtual art show where students can pick and choose and create their own art show using their best works from this current semester. Students choose to put their artwork in their own virtual art show. They add themselves. They add other things in the background to make you have the feeling that you are in an actual museum. Thanks again for watching Leo Green Studios. For more videos, please subscribe and like and share. Thank you.